And now with hundreds of thousands of COVID-19 vaccines and only a selection of the population eligible to get them, many vaccines are unfortunately left to spoil at the end of every day. But Israeli tech is now moving to create a solution for that as well. And here with more is James Spiro, reporter at CTEC by Kalkalist. Now, thank you so much, James, for being with us. We know that the vaccines can only last a couple of hours at most when they're outside of minus 70 to minus 80 degrees Celsius, I believe. You know, what does this tech do exactly to extend that life? Yeah, of course. So what Utiligent does is it, crea it creates an like, Internet of Things smart plug. Now, the smart plug reads the electrical current in any appliance. So what they did is they started with fridges, with coffee machines, uh, and they're since expanding to refrigerators. So the refrigerators are tracked by the smart plugs, and then um, people that store the, the vaccines in the fridges can kind of see the health of their refrigerator preventing any spoilage. So then make sure there's not any like warm spots or random things like that or... or yeah, you know, exactly. I mean... Consistent in the currency draw? Yeah, so these vaccines have to be kept, depending on who made them, they have to be kept at between minus 20 and minus 70. So it's really a problem when they're transported or stored that, that it's really kind of essential that they don't get spoiled. I mean, um, Utiligent was working with Ben & Jerry's and Ben & Jerry's used to say, well, you know, if we lose some ice cream in our fridge, we lose our ice cream in, in the fridge. But when it's, when it's vaccines for COVID-19, people really, the return on investment is quite high. It's not ice cream. Exactly. It's, right. All right, so, you know, is this, is this going to be maybe shared with the international community? Because I know that that's really a really big problem, especially in, in the United States, where hundreds of thousands of vaccines have gone to the garbage. Yeah, of course. It's actually a huge problem all around the world, um, especially now kind of tensions are quite high with COVID. Utiligent is used all around the world. It's used in uh, anyone can kind of purchase its, its device and use its platform. Um, in terms of branching out to HMOs, they're starting in Israel and let's see what happens with the rest of the world. But at the moment, they're used with, with coffee machines and other appliances. And so have we seen any, you know, is there data for how much longer this might extend the life of the vaccine after being removed from its original packaging? So I don't think it's about extending the life of the vaccine after it's removed from packaging, as it is transporting them. So I think... Make sure it, that it's not, it doesn't start degrading in the first place. Exactly. It's really about preventing the spoilage. You don't want to open up a cargo and find that there's hundreds of doses that have been damaged. Or you don't want to find out the refrigerator broke hours after the fact. You want to have a smart device telling you that there's a problem in, in the distant future. All right, well, I guess we have another reason to, to give credit for Israel's vaccination program. Yeah, it's a great accomplishment. Seriously, James, thank you so much for telling us about it. Thank you.